He is investigating a horrific car crash. It took the life of a mother and her three children. New video obtained by Action News 8 shows the aftermath of that crash on 156 just outside Hollister last night. The family was from Carmel Valley. Tonight, friends and family are remembering them. Action News 8 reporter Felix Cortez mm -hmm. is live outside the school where those children attended. Felix? And yeah, we're live outside Carmel Middle School, again with the three children attended class. Uh, school grief counselors and mental health experts have all been brought in to help staff and students as they deal with this tragedy, helping them to cope and understand it. Now that accident uh, claiming the life of a Carmel Valley woman and her only children. This is them from left to right. Ben, 12, his twin sisters, Leigh and Lucy, 14, and their 53-year-old mother, Lucy Biaganja. All three of them were killed when the Tesla their mother was driving veered into oncoming traffic and collided with the big rig on Highway 156 near Fairview, just outside Hollister. All four were pronounced deceased at the scene. The children's grandmother says the family was returning from a day spent at Casa de Fruta. It was a very long night not knowing. And it just seems you go along and then it's like they're really not coming back. They're not going to come back. The house is going to be empty. A big part of my life is just gone now. It's, who am I going to call when I... And I'm having an issue. Just, you know, it's, <laughs> they were taken way too soon. As far as the investigation, the CHP says it's unknown why Lisa Biagancha veered into the other lane. Her mother says her car was an older Tesla and not equipped with the self-driving mechanism. And we only bring that up because many of you have been asking and wondering that. And back here live at Carmel Middle School, a reminder to staff and students that health, mental health experts and grief counselors are ready, the, readily available for anyone who may need help coping with this tragedy that took the life of a Carmel Valley mother and her three children. Reporting from Carmel Valley, I'm Felix Cortez, KSBW, Action News 8.